long as I'm breathing. It is just God's life. It, everything is God. Everything is God. This is God's life. And if He puts in this life, you know, the, the feeling to, to be like this or to do this, uh, I, I, I do it. But it is no, there's no such me as my life. I don't want a life. I don't want a life for any me. It is not for me. I don't have no me. That my life, whatever it is that is having a sense I have a life, is dedicated back to God. And this is my declaration. I don't declare to the world, I declare in front of God. This is a, between me and God, if there is such a thing that exists. In the illusion of a separate me, this illusory me, who has a sense of autonomy, dedicate my apparent autonomy back to the Father. And it is like that. I am not holding my life. I don't want to hold my life. I don't want to hold on to life. I don't want to hold on to this body. You know, I don't want to hold on to any reputation. I don't want to hold on to any name. I just live in my father's light, and I am here in this way. I just I don't want nothing, nothing, nothing for, for myself. But I do have tremendous joy. This life is just full of joy and peace, and love for 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 love. That is the love is my life. The love is myself, my life. And the beings who I meet, they are my life also. They are inside. Even the bitter ones, the bitter and the sweet ones, they are all inside me. They are all inside my experience. And this is just it. I don't want to cling to any property or to any object or to any person, you know, yeah. or to even this sense of the body and this sense of individuality. I am offering it, I offer it, I offer it. More than I am saying it out there, I am saying it inside my heart. It is offered again to the Source. Mm-hmm. Because this body is only time. You know, what can I keep of time? You know, I exist eternally. It is enough. <laughs> I don't have to hold on to anything of any world. And this is my freedom. It is my freedom to express this. It is my freedom. This is my highest freedom. You see, and I can let it go. I can let it go now. It's my highest freedom that here the capacity, the intelligence of the self can express that this love is so complete, is so unfragmented, is so it is so unsoiled that it can only it as long you know it is very difficult to 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 that there's a body and there's an intelligence manifesting in it and the the feeling I am and even have the sense of um, interest or relationship with other beings, and to guarantee that that is, you know, separate from everything, uh, one has to be careful. But as much as it lies within the capacity of this consciousness to declare that it is nothing other than coming from the Father, even in its expressions of rightness and wrongness and meanness and newness, it is all coming from and exists inside the Father, who is one. And this is all. I don't have a life that I want to hold on to, or, or that I am holding on to. It is offered. It is offered moment by moment, day by day, year by year, life by life. It is like this. And uh, if I express it, it is to my joy. And that, you know, whether it is accepted or believed, it's not my business. It's not my business. I can only declare. You know, peace upon. Peace be to everybody, to everybody, the good and the bad. That's it. For me. What more I can say than this? I don't know. I am nothing. In fact, I am nothing. Uh, I am nothing because nothing of me I can keep. You see, I am only apparent in my in my physical manifestation, my phenomenal expression. It comes through this thing. You see, I have nothing to say about Muji. God can make a million Mujis. I am just uh, one tiny facet of infinite facets of the Supreme. That is all. Uh, so.